what's good guys and welcome to part two of the series that i'm doing on my natural hair in the first video i showed you guys what i used to shampoo my hair cleanse my hair and um pre-poo for my hair and in this video i'm going to show you guys what i use on my hair to help it grow and what i do to help my hair grow so um my hair is washed and detangled it is is still a little bit damp i'm gonna go over the products that i use in my hair to help it grow i don't like to use a lot of products in my hair because i don't like the scalp buildup um so i'm gonna go over the products that i like to use for hair growth so um what i have recently added to my routine is wild growth oil this stuff really really works and i'm not a big fan of like products that are super popular but this stuff is popular for a reason like it really works i've seen so much hair growth since i started using this um i like this and i have a oil mixture that i used in the first video for the pre-poo i like to use this a little bit of this in my hair and i'll use these two oils throughout the week and do scalp massages in my hair scalp massages really really help to bring circulation to the scalp and circulation to the scalp is going to circulate hair growth i have also created a little concoction using these two so the sulfur medicated formula mixed with the do grow um, I have mixed them together and put them in here this is what it looks like um, and I will put this on my scalp on wash day just because it does have a stronger smell than these other two and I don't I don't really like for the smell to linger throughout the week so I'll put this in here on wash day and then throughout the week I will use these two and um, just kind of touch up everything. So that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna put this in my hair and um, get it going. So next I'm going to put a small amount of this this oil in my hair this is Jamaican black castor oil um, I also like to put in some tea tree oil um, I have this one currently and it is 100% um, pure Australian tea tree oil or Melaleuca and um, it's pretty good um, I like that I like eucalyptus i like peppermint um, i'm not sure what's exactly in here i also like to use jojoba oils um, grapefruit olive coconut um, whatever i have on hand i like to use but i like to mix it in here um, so that i can get all of those benefits and um, i like to apply this throughout the week so I'm going to start at the edges and I don't use a whole lot because I again I don't like a whole lot of buildup and I will be applying this throughout the week um, so I'm just gonna do another little scalp massage can't get enough of this And I'm going to use a little bit of the wild growth oil. <laughs> I like to use all three of these because they all have different ingredients in them. So I get the benefit from all of the ingredients in my hair. And all of these things you can get at the beauty supply store. Um, a lot of it you can get at Sally's. I'm not sure about the wild growth oil though. I got this at the beauty supply store. I also used to do for 
hair growth is take care of vitamins i like these hair affinity these are the candy locks and they are like the chewable ones i like these a lot and i did see a lot of results i did get inconsistent with it that's why i still have some in there um but those really really help for hair growth and making your hair really thick um so that was something that i did well, hair vitamins are definitely something that um come from within when you drink a lot of water um that definitely helps your hair growth um the scalp massages help um, and with the hair vitamins, you do have to drink a lot of water. Otherwise, you get um, acne. I did anyway. Uh, on my, like, chest and my back, I would see a lot of, like, acne. And it's because I wasn't drinking enough water with the hair vitamins. Um, because they do have a lot of vitamins and nutrients and things in them. You want to make sure you're flushing it out. So, um, definitely another thing that I used to do um was i would use the rice water in my hair maybe i'll do a video on that how i like make the rice water and use it um that's another thing that i got inconsistent with but i did see hair growth with that um what else i don't know if it's called the flip over method um but it's where you like lay on the bed lay on the edge of the bed and your head like <laughs> your head like hangs off the bed and it kind of brings the blood to the head and while you're doing the scalp massage it pretty much produces hair growth because all of the blood and all of the circulation is here while you're doing the scalp massage so that you can see like immediate results with that within like a week you can see um there are different there are different videos on on youtube but other than that protective styling i look crazy look at my hair um, protective styling is going to be your friend if you want hair growth because you're not messing with it, you're not touching it, you're not snagging it. It's being put away, those ends are being put away and they're being preserved. So, um, but it's also important for your hair to breathe and to get some sunlight and to just do what it does naturally. So, um, that's what I use on my hair to promote hair growth um the scalp is really going to be the most important thing um if you look at the previous video i the way that i use my shampoo and my products i like to focus them on the scalp the ends and the scalp of your hair are going to be the most important and in the next video i'm going to show you guys how i take care of my ends when i style my hair so that they are moisturized and taken care of as well but the first two steps i like to focus on my scalp get everything into my scalp um so that i like to do that first so that it goes goes ahead and seeps into my scalp and starts to work um but yeah I don't know if you have any other questions about hair growth that's just what i do i try to keep it it seems like i'm doing a lot but i try to keep it as a at a mem, minimum because i don't like to do too much to my hair and i don't like to have my hands in my hair okay so i hope you guys stay tuned to the next video because i'm looking silly right now but next video i'm gonna be looking bomb okay Stay tuned to the next video where I style my hair and I love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And yeah, that's all I got. Love you guys.